Hey guys, welcome to our hotel room in Kyoto. This is what 8,000 yen gets you in Kyoto currently. Okay, hi everyone. This is our hotel review in Kyoto. This hotel room costs us about 8,000 yen, which is about 90 Singapore dollars. Let's check it out. Wow, look at this room. Welcome to my room. It's actually very spacious. More spacious than average hotels, I think, that we have stayed in Japan. Yeah. So, as you can see, right, the decor is quite modern, modern Japanese. Uh, modern de wafu na interior. Mm. So, you see the floor, it has like the tatami, tatami. section and the wooden, like, so, modern section. So, kino, yugo. Wow. Bed is very big. We got two single adjoining beds because we were afraid the beds would be small. So yeah, they're very big and spacious, actually. The pillow was very flat though. Yeah, 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 it's quite flat. You added that cushion, is it? Yeah, the mattress was a little bit flat, so it's a little bit flat. It's a little bit flat, so it's a little bit flat. Check out the lamps. It's also quite, quite nice, la. quite unique. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. The color also. We got the outlets here, and the charger, phone charger. There's an outlet here, and the cable. Japan plug. And there are some interesting buttons here. Actually, is it interesting? I don't know. It's not so interesting. <laughs> so, actually, uh, this, one, this one is to let you adjust the blinds. Here. You want to see? You want to see the. Uh, yeah, okay, adjust it now. Okay, I'll show you. I press down. Okay. How about we put it up and check out the view? Okay, let me see. The stop. view, uh, oh, not bad, not bad. It's okay, la. there's no street view, it's like building. We're just next nothing? to another hotel, actually. But the location is very convenient. We are yeah, right along the beach. Location is amazing. Yeah. This hotel is the most important thing in the location. It's very close to Kamogawa, and it's very close to Sanjo. So if you close up the close up the window, is this traditional Japanese paper uh, windows? Which it's are only like cool. a four minute walk to Sanjo, mm -hmm. a six minute very walk to Shijou Gion, which is the are the two major stations yeah. around this area. Then over here we have like a little desk, we have a clock, and they have this very useful spray. Which are apparently removes ninety nine percent bacteria and virus. We sprayed around everywhere. Yeah, and doesn't contain alcohol, uh -huh. so I think it's it's quite safe to use. And they have a kettle. kettle. Oh, this is interesting. Yeah, yeah, this box. So guess what? It, ne. Guess guess what's inside? Three, two, one. Wow. wow. So we are in Kyoto, right? So this is, I guess, the famous Kyoto Uji Matcha. Uji Matcha, yeah. Uji, Uji Matcha. matcha. Oh. And you have this little okay. thing for you to read and the normal tea bags. Ah, you can take home if you want. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to. <laughs> uh, yeah. Then the fridge. Unfortunately, which, nothing inside. Yeah, nothing inside. Not more than that. And the three drawers here: cups, menu, uh, dryer, the handphone chargers as well. And the last one is so oh, it's a bit messy, but it's like the I used it. <laughs> pajamas for sleeping. And they ah, have this, yeah. Kashizuki. It's quite common in Japanese hotels. Because it's very, it gets very dry. dry. It got this kahun gekitai function, What's which that? means that uh, it will eliminate the pollen. Uh, I don't think it's working because look at me right now. Uh, wow, very tough, very difficult. Mm -hmm. But okay, so you want to check out the toilet? Yeah, okay. let's go. Not to forget, we have a TV here. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, check out the toilet. Ready? Yeah. yeah. It's quite standard. standard la. Japanese a bath, a toilet bowl, Japanese toilet bowl. Everything in one room. Sink. We call this the unit bath in Japanese. Unit bath? So, you know, Japan is very limited in uh, space, right? Mm. So, everything in one space. It's like, like Bath's Singapore style toilet. Singapore. Oh, yeah, Singapore like this. Uh. Everything yeah, yeah, yeah. combined one. Too. Okay, there are these little pouches for us. I don't know whether we can take this home, but basically inside it contains like hairbrush, your toilet amenities, la, toothbrush and all that. Yep. So this is it, our room in 
Kyoto for one night. I would say it's very value for money because I, I think mean, the original price is way more. In Agoda, it is 40,000 yen. Yeah. Agoda, the 4,000 yen no. 正規料金なんですか今、多分コロナで安くなってて、8000円で止まりました。8000円や90シンガポールドル。It's like one quarter of the normal price. It's a steal for the location. Yeah, and... super, lo- yeah. super convenient. How about we show the, the, the lobby and the surroundings so you guys、okay. can get a hang of what's around? Hey, let's go. じゃあちょっとホテルの周辺を見ていきましょう。So, this is the lobby. And if we go straight here, this is called the living lobby. It's basically where you can、uh, take a rest. Also, enjoy some coffee here. Complimentary. We got some toilets here. Yeah, I mean, like, it's, it's just so nice the ambience here. Okay, let's check out the surroundings. So, what's cool about this hotel is that, okay, we, there's a mini museum here. And it's because、uh, this hotel is built at the site of the temporary residence of Shoujiro Goto. Goto Shoujiro no Kenchiku no way ni tatte mas ne, kono hotel wa. So, a long time ago, it used to be like this. And that's the hotel. Okay, let's check out how the hotel, how the surroundings look like. Ah, so beautiful, Kyoto. This place is really the location of the best place. So, if we go here, we'll reach Kamogawa, which is the most popular river. A lot of people like to do some picnic or just relax and chill. It's just a little bit of a ramen shop. That's a ramen shop. A potential supper spot for people staying around the hotel. So, so. And, eh, to, at the point, it's just a little bit of 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 a little bit Uh, Sanjo Station over there. Only like three or four minute walk. Oh, look at the sakura leaf. I mean, the sakura. Sakura ga yuki no yoni matete me chiki de ese. So beautiful. Fine like snow. Unfortunately, sakura is probably going to be completely gone in a week or so. I already see a lot of the leaves. もうすでにたくさんのまあ葉桜ですねもう葉っぱが生えてきてますね残念ながら。This morning I was enjoying my coffee around here. It's just so beautiful everywhere in Kyoto. 本当京都どこ歩いても綺麗ですよね。ほら、どこ歩いても風情がある。Incredible. It's nice how there's lots of like izakayas and local bars around here as well. Let's wait for my wife. She's buying some,、uh, some drink over there. Tsuma ga soko de choto jihan ki de drink kat tere ne choto machi mashou ka. Sanjo soko. De kochi ga kyoto shi, eh, shijou, shijou gion. Walk straight there, we'll reach shijou gion. What do you get? Oh, your milk tea. Wow, hot, hot, hot. hot one ah. Wow, Royal Milk Tea. It's like an anime setting, right? <laughs> like an anime to get the song. Wow, it's gas. Is it gas me?、Mm. Okay, try.、Yeah. Okay, this is a review of Kocha Kaden. It's a very popular、uh, brand. Kocha Kaden no Singapore Jin Yoru review. Okay, go for it. <laughs> nice or not? Mm, a bit thin. Let's go to the shake. Wow. Let's go to the shake. 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 Let's go to
Okay, go see. Can I see the second one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, it's like snow, man. Okay, I try this, huh? Not too sweet, creamy, very nice aroma from the tea. Delicious. This situation of kocha is delicious. So we are at Minami de Minami and to Minami Daikoku Bashi Dori Street. Yeah, it's probably impossible for foreigners to read that. <laughs> so long. Long for us Japanese too. Like before coming to Kyoto, this trip I was like, ah, like it's my like 10th time to Kyoto. I'm not so excited. But like when I reach and just look at all the scenery, I'm like, wow, never mind. I love Kyoto. Simply amazing. Kyoto mo nankai mo kiteru kara. Mo sasuga ni akiru da no na to mote, sonna kitai shane kita ですけど and if we go here, we will reach the Ponto Chou Alley, which is this. It's amazing, especially at night, you know. All the izakayas and like the restaurants, bars will open. This little alley will turn into red. Wow. But a lot of the shops are touristy, so it's very difficult, even for Japanese like me, very difficult to find the non-touristy, you know, the, the real the real nice bars that the locals go to. Yeah, it's a gorgeous little alley. Kyoto is full with this small alley. Which is why it's that's why it makes it so interesting, you know. Just walk into a random alley and you'll find something new. Kyoto And a lot of the shops, right? The actual entrance is all inside. So what's interesting is that of course some shops you can go in from here, but a lot of the shop you cannot go in from here. The entrance is over there. So you gotta go in deeper first. So interesting. So some of the local delicacies in Kyoto are not the yakiniku, but uh, obanzai. Maybe we can find some. Kyoto no ne, ano obanzai to ka. Kyoto gurume chotto misetai desu ne. I know there are some uh, izakayas here serving obanzai. They're basically uh, the Japanese tapas. Uh, or, or in Japanese, we just call it okazu. So lots of different kind of food like beef, fish, veggies cooked in different methods. Uh, great with rice and alcohol. Are you okay? What, what, are you okay? Huh? Wait, 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 what, why? Uh? Don't scare me. Yeah? Oh. I heard some weird guy make a sound behind, so scary. Are you so sorry? Like Are you okay? I'm oh, so sorry. Can we see him? No? I never see anyone. Are you sorry? Yeah. I hope you're okay. I'm glad you're okay. My wife, <laughs> my wife always meet these weird people in Japan. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Hey, don't worry, I got your passport. Do you hear? You never hear. No, I never hear. Like, <coughs> maybe, maybe it's just a. Maybe, maybe you know, it's, it's the very unique guy. Last time I met the weird guy at Shibuya, he also make weird sounds. Are you? Like that, and then touch me. Yeah, so sorry. <laughs> No, this is not a yokai street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Tumaga, go to my tete. It's 
美味しいもんね。Okay, okay. Bye bye. So I wanted to、uh, find a, like a, a bar or restaurant serving the boat, Kyoto food. So we have Obanzai, the, the Japanese tapas. We also, Kyoto also got、uh, Saba sushi, the fermented and vinegared Saba. Very nice. And we also have,、uh, what else are in Kyoto? What else? I forgot. But、um, Kyoto is not traditionally known for sushi. I know foreigners, a lot of foreigners think like Japan equals sushi, and it's, it's correct. But traditionally, Kyoto, because it's not facing any sea, it was difficult for them to get fresh fish. That's why、uh, fish were, especially saba, saba caught in the Sea of Japan, were、uh, pickled. Or vinegared. And that, then it was brought here to Kyoto. That way, the saba will not rot. That's why your、uh, saba, pickled saba, vinegar saba, is a local delicacy in Kyoto, which is still eaten today. Ah, this type of sakura is still like full bloom. Full bloom. There are a lot of types of sap- sakura. Some are already like gone. That one. See a lot of the green leaf, right? But this one still got a lot of the petals. Sakura mo shiri niyotte mada s a i t e r e n d e s ne. Ah, d e m o kore mo mo hazakura ga m i t e k i m a s h i t ne. So the alley will still continue over there. Maybe three minute walk and we will reach the big road. It's like the orchard road of、uh, Kyoto. Uh, I think I'll end the, end the stream here. Thank you so much for joining. This, is, this was a pre recorded live stream because the signals are not good inside buildings. So that's why I had no choice. I had to pre record this. But if you enjoyed it, please leave a like.、Uh, I hope to see you again in Japan. Thank you so much. 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 Thank you so much.